So today I'm gonna to teach you guys how to bunny hop in Apex Legends season 15, okay? So what is bunny hopping? In the past, what they allowed you to do was, is that you would have, let me drop this armor. You would be able to move in and bunny hop and heal at the same time and cover a vast distance. So bunny hopping allows you to continue your momentum while you are moving right this is broken right because normally if you're just running you slide jump and you got to turn this allows you to keep momentum create distance and possibly not get down it's happened to me a few times but still okay so in the past what it allowed you to do was slide jump and heal and cover that same distance now they've updated it to where you slide jump and if i heal my momentum's just instantly gone right if i slide jump and try to heal you can take about two and a half steps and then your your momentum's completely gone. So they took it away. Okay, now bunny hopping is just that. It's bunny hopping. So you slide jump and then you bunny hop around, you get around a corner, boom, good to go. Okay, it's a way to get out of, you know, a hairy situation. You're being shot at, you're almost down. It allows you to kind of get away and create even more space. Now, how do you do it? How do you bunny hop? Okay, if you're on controller, you have to be on crouch. You have to be. Saying This isn't saying that you can't do it on toggle. You definitely can, but you're gonna have to time both of these at the same time while you're doing it, and it's really, really hard. Now, toggle makes it super easy. All you have to do is hold your crouch button. On PlayStation, it's A. On Xbox, it's B. Or no, yeah, on Xbox, it's B. On PlayStation, it's Circle. So you hold that, and then all you're going to do is press your jump button, which is A or X, with the corresponding controller, okay? Now, to do it, what you're going to do is you're going to hold slide, right? Hold your crouch the entire time. Every time you're about to hit the ground on a bounce, you press your jump button again. So you're going to slide, bounce, 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 okay? It's just timing. That's all it is. Very easy to do. You can do it to get around corners and just go anywhere that you want to go. Now, that's how to do it. Now, let's talk about just a couple things. Now, the reason you see me going back left and right is to create even more momentum so then that way I can go farther on the bunny hop. Okay? So you can slide jump and just go straight, but you lose momentum after a while, you see? But... If I go at an angle like I'm driving a car, going 11 and two, I can go much farther. So again, we slide jump, right? Start bouncing, turn it, turn it, and we can go farther, right? And then just keep going, no problem, okay? So you wanna turn your camera to make sure that you don't lose on momentum so you can bunny hop farther, okay? Now you don't wanna change your camera angle too fast, right? Because if I do this, then you know I'm all over the place, right? You wanna try to steady it, so then that way you can keep the momentum from the bunny hop, you see? I'm like barely moving it, so that way I can just bounce around. No problem. Okay, second thing, you guys see me playing Horizon right now. Horizon is an added bonus when it comes to bunny hopping on controller because of her passive ability, Spacewalk. You increase the air control and reduce fall impacts with Horizon. This applies to jumping and sliding, okay? This is why she can go much farther. Not to say that other legends can't, but this is one. If you guys want to fact check me on that, you can, but I'm pretty sure her passive works that way. Let me know down in the comments. Now, on top of this, this is how you bunny hop. This is how you get around. Now, a couple of things I want to talk about. I have a scuff controller, okay? So I have four paddles on the back and I have them with corresponding jump and uh, crouch, okay? So that makes bunny hopping for me very easy. If you are on console or PC with a controller and you do not have a controller with paddles, this is what I suggest to you. You're gonna go into controller, go to button layout, and you're gonna go to bumper jumper, okay? You can go to bumper jumper. This allows you to put jump, or if you want, you go to puncher or button puncher. Now, what this does is either one is gonna be crouch or jump. Now, we kinda want L1 to be jump and R to be crouch, right? This way we don't, we don't lose taking our thumbs off the paddles, okay? So the best way that I found to do that is to come down and customize. So you're gonna come down and customize and you're gonna wanna change jump to L1 and you're gonna wanna change crouch to R3. So what this does is allow you to bunny hop if you do not have paddles, okay? 
So every time you see me punch, that's gonna be as if I'm pressing my jump button. You know, now if you can get away with it and do it without either one of those and just do button jumper and bunny hop a couple places and get around, you know, or maybe you play claw and you can do it this way, perfect. But you're gonna have to change those if you're not using a controller with paddles, guys. You're at a bit of a disadvantage if you don't, but it can still be done. A great example of this is Verholst on TSM. He does not use uh, paddles at all. Everything is designed on his basic controller. Okay, so again, guys, bunny hopping, we're gonna go over one more time for you for the video, but you're gonna wanna have button layout on, or excuse me, uh, crouch button on toggle, or excuse me. We're gonna go over it one more time, guys. How to bunny hop, crouch on hold, you're gonna slide jump and hold crouch and then tap X every time you hit the ground to create the momentum and you're gonna kinda wanna strafe left and or right to keep that momentum going. This is how you crouch or, or bunny hop on controller in Apex Legends in season 15. Thank you guys so much for watching. Comment, like, subscribe, do all that great stuff. Let me know down in the comments if this has helped you so we can make more guys like this for you. As always, stay gaming and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.